So the next cultivar that I'd like to cover in this series is a Jerry Lehman selection called Maria's Joy. Now Jerry Lehman has about four or five outstanding cultivars that are just absolutely delicious. Um, this one is unique in that it makes a small tennis ball sized fruit. You can see the, the fruit is a reasonable size. Um, it's neither more nor less papa than you feel like eating in a given session. So um, the flavor is a little bit different uh, than some. It's, it's a very standard papa flavor. Uh, however, it's a bit heavy on the bubblegum tones, uh, what I call the flat bubblegum tone. Um, you'll see the skin comes off rather easily with this cultivar. Um, and there's only two seeds in a chunk of flesh about this size, which is also good. Um, the texture of the flesh is very soft. It's almost mushy, but not quite. And a lot of Lehman's cultivars are like this. They're not particularly firm, and uh, they're not chiffon like, like Susquehanna is, wet marshmallow. This is genuinely mushy, um, but that's okay. Um, let me see if I can describe the flavor for you. There's the seed. Yeah, what I mentioned earlier about the dominance of that flat bubblegum taste, that is strongly there, almost to the point of being slightly bitter toward the end. Um, it is a very strong Moya backbone to the flavor, the custard apple uh, typical flavor, Moya. Um, and it is sweet. This cultivar is particularly sweet, um, almost to the point of cloying if you're not into sweet stuff. So you have to have a sweet tooth to really like this cultivar. Um, other than that, I'm not sure there's much more I can say about it. Uh, it's a fantastic cultivar for people who want little hand-sized pawpaws that are uh, perfect for serving individually. So one of the things that makes Maria's Joy nice is that she makes these nice tennis ball sized fruits in small hands like this. Um, and these hands are cool because they can sometimes ripen at uh, the same time, meaning you can take the whole hand, uh, which is something that a lot of papas don't do. They don't tend to ripen all at once, but that is something that Maria's Joy more often than not seems to. So that's one of the perks of this cultivar.